Okay, so this is a question about debt covenants, affirmative and negative debt covenants, positive and negative debt covenants. Which of the following example of an affirmative debt covenant? The borrow is A, prohibited from uh, entering into mergers, B, prevented from issuing excessive additional debt, or C, required to perform regular maintenance on equipment and pledged as collateral. Right. The easy way to remember this is negative covenants, debt covenants are going to be things that are very restrictive. Positive ones, these are things you should be doing anyway, right? So prohibitive from entering into mergers. Yeah, that could be something that's in the debt covenant, but entering into mergers is also a risky business, uh, generally uh, speaking. So this is actually a negative, considered a negative covenant right here. Uh, B, prevented from issuing excessive additional debt. Well, as somebody that is owed money, you don't want to see... Uh, the company adding more debt to their to their balance sheet, that's a negative covenant. That's something that restricts them from something that they would they would do possibly to grow to do other stuff, and it's a restrictive covenant. So it's a negative covenant, affirmative debt covenant. So C is required to perform regular maintenance on equipment pledged as collateral. All right, requiring regular maintenance. Yeah, this is a reduction of risk, but it's also you know that's something that they should be doing anyway. So. Uh, uh, the correct answer is C on this problem. C is the correct answer. The other two are not positive covenants. These are negative covenants.